to Asian at Home and today I'm going to show you how to make Milfeyo Nabe. It's a Japanese dish that's inspired from French dessert Milfeyo. Milfeyo means thousands of leaves. It is a beautiful and delicious dish. It is perfect for entertaining for your family and friends. What I'm gonna show you today is totally Korean take on it. So I hope you guys enjoy. Let's get started. First, we are going to make the dipping sauce. You will need 3 tablespoons of soy sauce, 1 teaspoon of sugar, half of lemon zest, half of lemon juice, and 1 cloves of chopped garlic, and 1 green chili chopped, and last, Korean ultimate stock. 3 tablespoons of Korean stock. You can use vegetable stock or chicken stock as well. Stir the sauce until sugar is dissolved. So my sauce is ready. Now time for the main star, which is the cabbage and the protein. Napa cabbage is the classic to use for this milfeu nabe, but if you add these little dark green leaves, it's really, really beautiful, like white, light greens and dark greens. They are just amazing, amazing presentations. Um, you can use any kind of dark green leaves that you can find at the grocery store. I used the bok choy before, I used the different stuff, but I found that this kale is amazing as well. So I'm going to use this kale today. So first layer is Napa cabbage, and I'm going to add this very thin cut beef. Or you can ask your butcher to cut thin as possible, or you can go to Asian market and get the shabu shabu or bulgogi meat that they cut really really thinly. And cabbage, beef, and I'm going to add this kale. And I'm just gonna cut the kale the same length as cabbage. Now I'm gonna top with the pork, but you can use only one type of meat, of course. Next, cabbage. See, you just keep going on like this. Cabbage, meat, green leaf, meat, on process. Now this is the beauty part and you have to be really careful, make sure your knife is very sharp. You're going to cut down in half and quarter. Bottom of the pot, Place about three cups of bean sprouts. It's about eight ounce. Place cabbage and meat layers from around the edge of the pot cut side up. Fill up the middle with any type of mushrooms. And now we're gonna pull four and a half cups of ultimate Korean stock or whatever stock you're using. And this is totally optional. If you like to add a couple tablespoon of sake and season with 3 tablespoons of soy sauce or 1 and a half tablespoon of salt. Normally this dish is cooked on the table, but today I'm just going to cook on the stove. Either you cook on the stove or cook on the table, you have to bring it to boil over high heat with the cover on and reduce it to medium and simmer until it's all the way cooked through. It takes about 5 to 10 minutes. This is a Korean take on of Honju sauce. But if you want the classic Japanese shabu shabu sauce, go check out my shabu shabu video and the recipe. inspirations and idea of Asian home cooking. Thank you so much for watching me today and remember you can always cook Asian food at your house making it easy and fun. I'm Sangyang Longast and this is Asian at Home and I will see you next time. <laughs>